Welcome back. I'm again here with Oscar De La Hoya and Jennifer Jimenez. Oscar, you mentioned something going out to break. Uh, I've been trying to get people to understand that Whitney Houston standing there with a glass of champagne was an emergency. Uh, I've been criticized for that. Pe Wh uh, Whoopi Goldberg just uh, slammed me for saying that. Uh, people don't get that. How would we get that message across? What did you see when you see her there with that glass of champagne? Well, I mean, it's like it's like literally holding one bullet in that in that holster, you know, and holding a gun. I mean, it's it's literally like that, you know. It's like once you're an alcoholic, you're always going to be an alcoholic, and if you only had one drink, well, it always leads to something else. It always leads to another drink, you know, and people don't understand that. I think people have to just be educated about it, you know, and people that don't drink, you know, that don't have a problem, don't they, get they it. just do not get it. Jennifer? That, again, it's like we're bringing so much awareness out that, you know, you you do need to learn this because everyone's affected by alcohol and drug addiction and it's like you know that half pill could kill you that my dad he died at 48 he wasn't active in his addiction but he was an addict and yeah and you guys and we've been talking a lot about pharmaceuticals and drugs but we we mustn't forget alcohol in terms of the biggest impact on people's health and this society alcohol is the one and we sort of we sort of push that one aside because we all well, we, we like alcohol it's too acceptable. much. Of course, yeah. and look, and there's and I'm not saying okay, people stop drinking. No, that's that's people can drink, but then there's people that cannot drink, mm -hmm. like myself. You know, we just and there's millions and millions of people that cannot drink. And, and you can't drink, you can't smoke pot, you can't no, take pills, you it, can't. And, it all again, goes hand in hand. You have to people, feel. But, you're but, you're but, like have to feel your feelings now. Like well, that's the stage he's in right now. But how do we get people to understand that if you if you have been addicted to alcohol, you all the others will trigger the same mechanism? Is there a message you can give people? That I seem to be unable to reach them clearly about I, this. I really do think. I mean, it, it's going to have to start with with school, with with the kids educating them let's say in high school when so they can make that transition into college because look kids are dying kids are drinking and dying and taking pills and this and that going into college at a young age why not just educate them why not just you know make it part of life you know so at least they have a chance to live I think you also need somebody who has been there too because mm -hmm. if it's somebody if like me in the white coat up there it's gonna be like yeah whatever right. <laughs> but, but Jennifer it's Lesworth. true like in one of the things too is like if you have the gene if you suffer from addiction if you take that pill or drink or drug you awaken that beast that's just waiting there to size you up to get you in some way before we go out uh, Oscar any any thoughts I'm gonna get into the Chris Brown and Rihanna story in the next next break after the next break uh, do you have any thoughts about that those two nah I, I just feel like I mean it's it's um, I guess maybe a time bomb waiting to just yeah, go that's off what we're worried you know, about. Um, that's what we're concerned it's, about it's I mean look yes they can be together or whatever but they have to or he has to or she has to or they both have to just get help because Change. maybe they're not even made for each exactly other right. oscar thank you so much i, I think i think you, you will help more than one person today and jennifer as always thank you for thank joining you us for having me. coming up i'm going to take your questions and calls remember no topic is taboo and later on as i just brought up with uh, oscar we're going to talk about domestic violence rihanna was a victim but there are reports that apparently she's getting back with chris brown Pres hilton uh, did a report on this Weigh in on this topic and others at HLNTV.com. Let me know what you're thinking. And also, tell me what questions you'd like to ask during one of these blocks like we're going to have in the next segment. I'll, I'll talk about any topic you guys want to get into. We'll be right back after this.